Hey YouTube, it's Weird Paul. It's mail day again, and today's package comes from subscribers Owen and Silas Camp. So, let's take a look at what I got. I got an alien and a ninja, a Fisher Price little person, and this 1991 monster in my pocket Drood figure. That's rare. And a 1992 Batman Adventures pin. I'm Batman. Plus these vintage looking kawaii stickers. That is wild. And this 1943 postcard. <laughs> and I got some treats to try. First up is the Tropical Pineapple Marshmallow Hello Kitty Candy from Sanrio with pineapple jelly inside. Pineapple marshmallow. This should be pretty interesting. So they are marshmallows. And they have kind of a cotton candy kind of smell to them. For nearly the whole time that you chew this, you're just going to be tasting the marshmallow taste. It isn't until you've swallowed almost the whole thing that you suddenly taste all of the pineapple. Not bad. Unless, of course, you don't like marshmallow. Next up, the individually wrapped Fruchsia Peach Gummy Candy from Kasugai with real fruit juice. Peach Gummy Candy. Now, these are going to be individually wrapped for your protection. Those are pretty good. I'm not a huge fan of gummy candy, but the peach flavor is really strong. It's really sweet. It's delicious. I think I'm going to like to eat the rest of these. Now I'll eat the lot of chocolate filled koala cookies. Hey, hey, hey everybody. It's me. I'm a cookie. <laughs> mm. I like cookies. So each of these little cookies has a koala printed on it. See that right there? Yeah. These, these are, they have a different koala on them. Okay. One, one's a, a, a little a girl koala maybe, and a little boy koala looks like maybe. Just eat them both. Very, very crunchy outer cookie shell. Mmm. Again, it's um, the, the, the chocolate is inside, so you don't really taste it at first until you've already swallowed most of it, and you really taste the chocolate. That's good. Two great tastes, one after the other. Finally, we got some cute little gums, and the ingredients include paprika. <gasps> Each of these gums has a different little animal on the package and a different color and they're all different flavors from what I can see. One is banana. I'm not going to eat that one because I do not like banana. Banana, uh, the flavor of banana actually makes me nauseated. I can't even eat bananas anymore. I don't know why. I'm gonna try what looks like the grape flavor with the little monkey on, on the front. And I'd just like to say I really like the packaging on this. I like these cute little boxes different colors with the, with the uh, animals. Gum. Wow, I don't know if it's the paprika in this or what it is. The paprika. Something in this is very, very, there's like a, a lot of taste to it. Very flavorful, but not just sweet. It has sort of almost like a I don't know what you'd call it. It's like almost a little bit of a spicy flavor to it. 
It's very interesting. I've never had gum that tasted like that before. And I got some trading cards. Two Star Trek TNG cards, three Star Wars Galaxy cards, seven 1977 Star Wars cards, and one 1990 Rad Dudes card. Excellent! Four Pokemon cards, nine Harry and the Hendersons cards from 1987, and nine 1993 Beatles cards. Please, everybody, if we haven't done what we could have done, we've tried. Plus these cool old card wrappers from Awesome All-Stars, Batman, and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Cowabunga! And yet, I was most excited about the stamps that they sent me for my stamp collection. I got 59 stamps from outside of the U.S. Many of these very old stamps are from countries in Central and South America. And I got over 1,100 United States stamps. Damn! I've only looked through the ones from before 1970 so far, but I already filled in 26 empty spots in the stamp album that I've been filling up for the last 40 years. And that leaves me with a feeling of satisfaction. 1960s Food for Peace stamp. 1950s Land Grant Colleges Stamp. 1940s U.S. Army Stamp. 1938 Chester Arthur Stamp. Even a 1926 Airmail Stamp. Thanks so much to Owen and Silas Camp for so many treasures, and for this funny fart card, too. <laughs> Owen has a music project called Mess, and you should check it out. The link is below in the video description. I'll see you soon with more memories. Thanks, YouTube. Just keep eating these.